What's up, beautiful people? This is day nine of 365 days. Can you believe? Can you believe I made it this far? I can't believe it. But anyway, let's get right into it. Today's gonna be a short video, and I want to speak on enemies because the devil is not the only enemy in our lives. Sometimes it's people we love, friends, families, relatives. Who knows, right? And sometimes it's even people we entrust or who have authority over us, right? And that could be your teachers, employers, and even the government. The feds, any of the above, and people who we have never met belittle us in insignificant ways, and that might just be economic status, social status, even in terms of race. It happens. This video is supposed to serve as a reminder to some of y'all. God will use your hardship and the enemies with hardened hearts in your life to strengthen you and utilize your life for His glory, just as He did. For the Pharaoh of Egypt, God had hardened the Pharaoh's heart because he was already hardened. He wasn't going to believe, so God put him in that state to prove to his people and to prove to him that God is and God will. Being a believer doesn't mean we have an easy life. You got to remember, Jesus did not have an easy life, right? And we are called to live our life like Jesus to the best of our ability. Jesus living in that hardship is an example of what we can expect. We're not called to be people of the earth. We're called to be God's people in heaven. God has a purpose for everything that he puts you through and your journey. And he will carry you. He will guide you. Whenever you feel alone, developing and strengthening your trust with the Lord and faith with the Lord is really what's going to make those unbearable times more bearable because we have to go through it. And God is really the one who's going to carry you through. This message is really short and I needed it. You needed it. And if it ain't you, someone on your story is going to need it. So please share it. Get the word out there. But before you go, please start to comment. What more do you want from me? Um, what can I provide for you? Anything. Let's help each other. Let's build this and make it a community. God bless.